City of mine How I love, how I love The city of mine It Good never morning. gets Good morning, welcome to the birthday vlog Baby boy It's mommy's birthday today I'm all 26 years old I uh, went out and got my Starbucks this morning They forgot to put cold foam on it Because I only ordered a grande So they poured it in a venti cup And they gave me so much cold foam I was like, you know what, it's fine, go with it Birthday drink uh, And I got a chocolate croissant as well Because it just sounded really good this morning Haley's so sweet <laughs> Look what she left out for me this morning Get you a roommate that truly knows you. I am obsessed with these. <laughs> and energy drinks to uh, get us through the weekend. I love it. Thank you, Haley. So, the plan for today. Leanna is going to come over probably in the next few hours. And we are going to go to uh, Pasea, which is a hotel pool. So, we found out about this thing called Resort Pass last year. And basically you can buy like a day pass to the spa, you can buy a cabana, you can buy day bed passes, stuff like that. So essentially you can get into all of these hotels, um, I think they have it like up and down the coast. So like LA to San Diego, there's a lot of different places that you can go. And you basically just buy the day pass, you get to hang out there all day. We did Pasea one time last year and it's like just like a really nice chill place so um we really only had two options because we booked it so late so we had like Pase and i think hilton so we just decided to do Pase again since it was a fun vibe so i think we're gonna grab brunch at the restaurant that they have there um and then we have dinner reservations later tonight at 6 30 at this place called bungalow in cdm it's different from like the bungalow in huntington and like Santa Monica, is that where the other one is? Or Long Beach? I can't even remember. I've only ever been to the Huntington one, but the actual bungalow restaurant. We're gonna go there for dinner, so very excited. Okay, I am ready. I decided to do my makeup just since it's not like too warm out today, so I don't feel like it'll like melt off. I'll probably end up having to redo it before we go to dinner later. Let me let that be on. You guys stand for this? Okay. But I really like how it turned out, so I'm gonna actually film like some TikToks and stuff until Leanna gets here to pick me up. But I have on the um, royal blue bikini from Princess Polly. This little crop tank is from Aritzia. Shorts are Levi's, I think they're also from Aritzia. And then this little jacket, just in case it's like cold while we're at um, brunch, breakfast. Oh, well, it's like 11-ish now. Um, I just wanted something to have to like throw on and then I just have like my little bucket bag from Zara over there. Let me know if you remember when I got that bag like two years ago. I still love it. Um, yeah, this is a little fit for today. I have no idea what I'm wearing to dinner later, but I don't have to think about that right now. So I'm not going to. Okay. I'm going to film some TikTok content and then I will continue to vlog once Leanna gets here and we head out. All right, we are at the Pasea. Leanna is here. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Cheers. We got some drinks. It's a beautiful sunny day out. I love it. Day. Okay. 
We are back home from the pool now. Changed into some cute fits. <laughs> yes. Cute little dress on. I have on this corset from Amazon. Um, pants are Ritzia. And then my high top or platform Converse for the fit. I got so much sun today. You can see my tan lines. They're looking real cute. I also got a little sunburn. So that's going to be so fun to deal with later. But we're going to head to dinner. I'll film what I can for you guys and we'll continue on this birthday vlog. Family has to be the star every time. Yes. <laughs> He's every given time. some love earlier. Now it now is playtime. Like, playtime. <laughs> Good morning. It's the next day now, and uh, it's 10 a.m. I slept in a little bit and woke up to no running water, so that kind of sucks. Um, I reached out to my landlord. I think he's going to try to figure out why they're doing a lot of like construction in our neighborhood over like the next three weeks, so I was like, did, did they just decide to turn the water off or something? Like, you know, I would have planned ahead and showered last night if i knew the water was gonna be shut off but it's okay it's it's all gonna be fine i wanted to go to the gym i could shower at the gym but then i also have to like pack a bunch of other stuff and that's a lot to think about right now after just waking up um let me let bentley in i'm gonna make myself breakfast and i guess figure out what i'm gonna do with my day because if we don't have running water that is definitely an inconvenience but hopefully that gets fixed soon i'm meeting my parents for dinner later tonight so i'm very excited i have not seen them in a while because i saw my mom when she came to watch bentley but we left probably like five minutes after she got here so it'll be nice to like have dinner with them spend a little bit of time with them make myself an acai bowl and then I do have to work on figuring out health insurance today because I am no longer on my parents' health insurance after the 30th of this month. So I need to get that figured out before the first so I can make sure that I'm covered with health insurance. It's all so confusing though, you know? I don't know why they make it so confusing, but it is. It confuses the heck out of me. Okay, I made my acai. It looks so good. I'm so hungry. And our landlord said my like, pipe broke apparently in the neighborhood, so they're fixing it right now. So thank goodness we will have running water shortly. So I'm gonna use that as my motivation to get to the gym today. There is a gym that's like down the street from me that I went there the other day and just honestly, I don't know. I think I had like mentioned this already, but I didn't love the vibe of the gym. So I think I might drive to the other one a little bit further away but the photos the vibe just look a lot better like i like how the equipment is like spaced out like at the gym that's down the street for me all the equipment is literally right next to each other and i just don't enjoy working out that closely to strangers <laughs> i like having the equipment just like a little bit more spaced out and just like a little bit more space in the gym so um i think i'm going to plan to drive over there today and he's eating the peanut butter out of the little cup <laughs> that i use um, I think I'm gonna plan to drive over there today get a workout in and just like check out that gym and then I still need to look into health insurance and get that figured out today. That is the plan. That is the goal. Okay, I am changed into a gym fit. We have shorts from Amazon, Metcons on. Um, this is my Cos sweatshirt and then I have on a sports bra from Forever 21. I mixed up my creatine and pre-workout already. I'm going to take it probably like halfway to the gym since the gym is a little bit farther. And I'm really going to pray that the water is back on by the time I get home so I can shower because I'm meeting my parents for dinner later. Uh, so I really hope that I can shower after the gym. Otherwise, I might have to hit up one of my friends and ask if I can use their shower. <laughs> this is this is life. This is you know it's okay there are there are other things that could be worse thankfully we still have power and everything but water it's just like so it's just an inconvenience you know i just it sounds like they're still working on the pipe outside um i'm thinking it's like the whole 
side of the neighborhood if anything like it can't just be our place because we're like connected to like a bunch of other <laughs> units so uh, i'm really gonna hope that it's fixed by the time i get home otherwise i think i might hit up one of my friends later and see if i can use their shower <laughs> I'll uh, update you guys on what is going to happen uh, with that, but I'm not going to bring my camera to the gym just because new time, first time at this new gym, and um, that's a lot for me all at once, so I'll get back into filming gym vlogs. Okay, so I drove all the way to the gym, and as I was leaving our neighborhood, I saw a sign that said, like, um, the water won't be turned on until, like, 5 p.m., so I drove all the way to the gym, and then I was, like, thinking in my head, and I was, like, if I work out, like I, I really didn't bring clothes to change into. I could have easily showered at the gym if I had brought stuff with me, but like I didn't fully think that far ahead. Like I knew that I like probably wouldn't be able to shower when I got back home. But then I like get there and I was like, why did I not just bring clothes? So I turned around, came home. I've also been dying of cramps for, from, since like 7 a.m. So it was already an iffy idea to go work out anyways, but yeah, I ended up just coming home and saying forget it. I will try again tomorrow. Our water is still not turned on. Um, I think I might maybe take the bike out to the beach or something and try to get out of the house because I feel like I'm just like sitting, sitting in my misery today. <laughs> um, anyways, on another note, Supergoop sent me a package. Um, I want to open it up and see because I use their sunscreen all the time. So I figured we'll do a little PR unboxing. Um, really quick so i've tried the unseen sunscreen that they have I don't mind the candy that they left me yesterday still sitting on the counter the unseen sunscreen um this one and i love it i haven't tried any of these other ones that seem to be in here which is kind of cool okay so they have watery lotion spf 50 that's really nice Kind of intrigued by this i was also watching another youtuber um i forget who it was i've just had like videos playing um while i've been sitting in my room since i got back from the gym um and they were talking about a deodorant that smelled really good and i need more deodorant because the one that i'm currently using is almost done and i bought the little like gel one from um what's it called necessaire and I like it, but I need it like in addition with like another stick deodorant. So I think I might run to Sephora and get more deodorant. And then there was like a lotion they were talking about too that they said smelled really good. So I might just run to Sephora today and get both of those. But anyways, I'm excited to try this. And then we have their glow screen. This is something that I was actually going to pick up during the Sephora sale. <laughs> So I'm really glad they sent this over and now I get to try it because it's just like glowy sunscreen. You guys know I love a good glow. And then this one is the unseen sunscreen. I only have like the little mini version of this right now, but this will be perfect, especially with summer coming to keep stuff in my beach bag and just for everyday use. So thank you to Supergoop for sending that over. I'm excited. Oh, they also sent over a little glow stick. Cute. Okay, I am set on sunscreen for a little bit. Perfect. It's the next day. I can't remember if I vlogged when I went out to dinner with my parents, but we had a reservation at Chart House in Dana Point, one of my favorite restaurants. I love Dana Point so much. So we went there, met up for dinner, and she gave me some birthday cake. My mom gave me some birthday cake from Susie Cakes, which is probably like my favorite cake place. Of course he starts making noise as soon as he hears the vlog camera turn on <laughs> baby boy um but yes she brought me some suzy cakes look how good this is this is probably my favorite cake place honestly they have one by my parents but i don't think they really have one over here i don't know i haven't truly looked but i had a couple bites this morning because i couldn't help myself it just looked so good i'll probably eat more of that later but let me close this <laughs> i am about to hello you want to focus camera nope i guess not today 
not at all there we go okay i am actually going to the gym today i am going to go take um my friend's class at cause 9 30 class right here that's so loud um this is the fit literally the exact same gym outfit that i had on yesterday it's something i never actually wore it to work out in um and then this crop is from aresia and i'm just gonna throw on my metcons honestly those are like my favorite top favorite shoes to work out in i have the black ones uh, but they're just they're not the same as the white metcons because the black ones that i have are the threes and these ones are the fours and i just the fours are so much more comfortable i love them so much more so i'll probably end up buying the fours in the black version or they have like a tan version that i really really want so eventually once i can find them in stock in my size i will be picking those up as well okay i gotta fill up my water bottle maybe take some pre-workout and i gotta go because otherwise i'm gonna be late to this class okay workout oh hello we're doing great workout class is done i am at uh the mall right now i stopped by ulta and got my favorite chai just a little friday treat you guys already know vanilla chai with oat milk oh, so dang good mm, so good i love chai so much okay there is two things that i want to look at at sephora i'm limiting myself to only getting these two things I better not come out with anything else <laughs> from Sephora. Um, but I need a new deodorant. I think I mentioned this already. Um, the one that I have is almost out. And then I started reusing my old um, Necessaire ones that I found in my medicine cabinet. And I realized that they were still full. So I've been using those. And they've been like burning my underarms. So I think... I might be slightly allergic to them now. So I think I'm gonna try something else and see if hopefully it doesn't do that because it's not a fun feeling to put on deodorant and then like have your underarms burn for a while afterwards. Um, it also could just totally be because it's like a natural deodorant or something, but I used to use them all the time and have no problems. And I started using them again and like it straight up burns. It's not, it's not a fun time. So there's this other deodorant that I wanna try and then um, some body lotion that I want to get if it smells good and if I'm not allergic to it I have to double check like the ingredient list to make sure before I buy it but I will uh, I'll show you guys what I end up getting after I'm at a Sephora <sighs> so good okay I left Sephora with only three things i got one other thing uh that i wanted because i couldn't get the other thing i couldn't get the lotion because i was allergic to it so i ended up finding a bronzer that i really wanted that's been sold out for a little while and then i also got another one of my uh favorite charlotte tilbury wallace filter in like a lighter shade so i'll show you guys a little haul when i get home and we have better lighting Okay, mini Sephora haul for you guys. Here comes Bentley. Oh, hello. Okay, it's not for you. It's not for you. All right, so these are the three items that I got. This is the Mason Louis Marie uh, deodorant. It smells so good. It smells like Santal, and I love it. I love that smell so much. So trying out this deodorant i think it's the same price as like the necessaire and like other natural deodorants so we will see how it is and if it is worth it um i'll let you guys know updates to come um and then i got a second um flawless filter this is in the shade three because right now i have 4.5 and i feel like by the end of the summer it'll match like a little bit better um but it does help anytime i use a lighter foundation if I need to like darken it up a little bit but I want to have this one just on days when like if I just want to wear this so this is in the shade three and then this is the bronzer that I've been wanting for a little while it's the makeup by Mario in the shade medium deep 
that what it was? Yeah. Oh, medium dark. And they were all out of it the last time I was at Sephora. So I got the Fenty one that I showed you guys in my Sephora haul. And I really like that one, but I did really, really want this one because I just love the shade of this one. It's just going to pop out. <laughs> so this, oh, so pretty. This is the bronzer. I'm definitely going to be using this when I do my makeup later. I might do a little get ready with me before we go out later tonight because we're going out tonight. And we are going to brunch tomorrow. I'm probably not going to vlog like the rest of the weekend, honestly. Um, I just want to like have fun and enjoy my birthday weekend <laughs> with all of my friends. So I'm going to vlog as much as I can of me like getting ready before we go out. And then hopefully I'll have this video up for you guys on Sunday. I'm going to try to sit today and edit a little bit of it so that when I like sit down on Sunday morning to like finish edits, it'll be pretty much like put together and I'll just have like whatever clips I have from like getting ready today. So I need to wash my hair still. I want to sit and edit this vlog, but I also want to sit outside for a little bit because the weather is so nice out. It's like breezy and sunny. And I don't know, I just feel like sitting outside for a little bit. I debated like taking the bike to the beach. I might do that as well. I don't know yet, but I'm not gonna fully shower until later since I'm gonna like lay out in the sun and I wanna have like fresh washed hair. And I also got my um, my curling wand with a clamp back from my mom because I had left it at her house and then she moved and so she had it like this whole time and um, she brought it last weekend when she came to visit. So now I can actually try to curl my hair with that We'll see how that goes later. Uh, but yeah, I want to curl my hair and go out tonight. I keep forgetting to buy hairspray because I keep having to borrow Haley's. I'm going to have to just order some on Amazon or like go to Target or something and get some.